Hi, welcome back to my channel Skillset Go. So in the previous tutorial, we have seen how to request an API, which is in the form of this URL, just a plain URL. And if any URL contains a placeholder and how to use that in using retrofit and how to get the result. And we have seen how to use a request parameter and how to pass a request parameter to API call using retrofit. In this video, we will see how to request a result with using post request. So now we will be connecting a post URL. So for testing purpose, I am running one Tomcat in my local system with this URL that is a post request. So that URL just returns a constant result every time like this user ID, ID, title, body. And this is a post request. Now we will get the same result using retrofit library in Android with using this URL. So for get we have created a method like, like this and in the same way let's create a method for post request. API will result this one this is in the form of post model which already we have defined user id id title body. So we are going to save the result in this post and we will name a method post request demo and we are not passing any param request parameters just a plain post request so in order to make connect this method to this URL we need to keep this URL top of this method at post and mention the URL demo API you can see demo API slash message that's it now we have mapped this method call to this URL and let's go to main activity and let's call that method so first we need to create a callback method where the result will be pulled callback which will take post so callback will override this method on response and on failure so on response this method will be called and the response is received from this parameter let's print that result from response we can get body and we can just print directly so response dot body will return post object so the post object we are printing just prefix with the my channel name so that we can search this log easily and if any error is there that will get response here we will just print the stack so now we will call exactly the API interface method we have created. So we have created a service which is retrofit instance. With that we can call post request demo. And we need to specify the callback method, callback object where the result should be pulled. And just pass this variable here. So upon calling this method this URL will be requested and we will get the result and here if you see we have only half of the URL the remaining URL we are putting while creating retrofit instance so in the previous demos we have connected with the other URL so we have kept this URL for this we need to keep this URL localhost 8080 So for demo purpose, just comment this and add our URL. And now let's execute this and see the result. We need to get 
the same result what we are getting in this request if you hit this url we will get this user id id title body let's execute this and see the result for filter purpose you can just search the prefix what we have given so we are not getting lost let's see any error is there it is saying failed to connect to localhost 12700188 yes upon preparing this video i have got this error and i have found the reason for this see the basically we are running this app in a emulator so we are not exactly running this app in a localhost so and we are trying to connect localhost so which is not happening so there is a bridge api between emulator and the local api lo and the local machine which is laptop so here we can't use localhost or 127.001 there is a bridge api 10.0.2.2 so now let's execute and see the result so as you can see now we have got the result skill set go we have got post user id 1 id 1 title and body and you can see body so this is how we will use a post request using retrofit 2 library in android so here we have kept 10.0.22 instead of localhost or 127.001 because the api the android project is running in the emulator not in the local machine so emulator is different and local mission is different so we are trying to access emulators local host so that's why it is not able to connect so 10.0.2.2 is a bridge api between emulator and the mission i hope you understood this video on how to use retrofit 2 library for getting the post request or post response for the api please watch more videos from my channel and thank you for watching